started here in about five minutes. We'll get started here in about five minutes, but there's plenty of seating over here as well. If you would like to not be so far on the side, feel free to come over here to the side of the tower in front of our front ensemble, and you are welcome to sit there as well. We'll get started in just a minute. Thank you. Hey, 
And these kids have really, really, really brought their best, and I'm really excited for you to see what they have for you tonight. Um, I think this is going to be an awesome show. For those of you who have not been here with us before, we like to start off by just showing a little bit of what we do every day during camp, and that usually starts with some fundamentals, whether that be music for our wind players, whether that be maybe working on some additional cadences for our percussionists, for our guard, that includes different fundamental skills, one of which is tossing, which we might show you a little bit of, in addition to our other choreography and flag work. So that's what we're going to start with now. So winds are going to do a warm-up that I think they had a lot of fun with, because it's kind of cool. So here are our brass and woodwind players with concert B-flat warm-up. Good one. 
So, type of that exercise if you're curious. They're listening and they're blending with each other even when they are playing those really ugly notes, right? So, listening and blending, cutoffs, attacks and releases is kind of all the purpose of that exercise. Our percussionists are next, and they are going to play Tasty for you, which is their main cadence. a fantastic percussion instructor, Mr. Zach Langer. He could not be here tonight, unfortunately. Um, he has been with us these past couple weeks, and for actually, uh, this is my third year here, and this is his third year here with us as well, and we have been very lucky to have him. He has done great things with our percussion. So, round of applause for Zach, even though he's not here. <laughs> Next up, guard, if you want to kind of come out here towards where battery is set up. Our guard is led by our color guard director, Miss Lucy Levia, and we are very fortunate to have her here as well. She helped start our color guard program here at Fairbanks. And she is going to show you some of the tosses and maybe one or two other things that the guard has been working on that you might see incorporated into our show choreography at some point. There's no great way to face, so because everybody's everywhere, so. Another round of applause for Lucy and our color guard. All right, next up, we are gonna do just a little bit of our basics block for you, and that is gonna be led by our drum majors, Kennedy Nurek and Nina Grigor-Nofsiker. They're gonna show you a little bit of what we do in our fundamental marching block. So, Ben, will you get into your pre-game fundamental block, please? While they get settled here, I would also be remiss if I didn't mention Brianna Dawson, or Brianna Dawson, who is our 
assistant, or our assistant director here. We are very lucky to have her. Unfortunately, because of some family things, she isn't able to be here tonight, but we are very grateful for everything that she does for us as well. So even though she's not here, would you give her a round of applause, please? And here are our drum majors. I don't know who's taking the mic. I'll take it. Hi. All right. Hi, band. We are going to do some music blocks. All right. Nina's going to count or clap, whatever, the same thing. And we're going to do just eight counts forward. Set. Which way? Place the sign. All right, facing the same direction, we're going to take eight steps backwards. Set. Eight steps backwards. Five, six. Good job. All right, now we're going to take eight steps forward, eight steps backward, and the same little thing. Direction change. All right, good set. What are we doing? Let's do some slides. All right. All right. You're gonna go uh, 16 counts forward, but you're gonna slide to your left. So slide face up. All right. Get set. What are we doing? Yeah, we can do better than that. Louder, please. What are we doing? Thank you. Thank you. Well, when we were originally supposed to be in the stadium, this was going to be a little cooler. But, Ben, will you go get set for pregame? We're changing pregame up just a little bit this year. So the way we're getting onto the field is going to look just a little bit different. So in our home game against Jonathan Alder, crazy enough, is that next week? That is next week. So week from tomorrow, home versus Jonathan Alder, band debut in the stadium. And you'll get to see pregame in all its glory this year. And I think they're excited for it, as you can probably kind of tell. I think they're chanting pile of dirt, because there's a little pile of dirt over there. And that's, that's band kids for you. All right, you guys ready? Call them to attention.
little modern. If you would please stand, remove any hats, and please join us in the National Anthem. That is our pregame routine this year. So, give another round of applause for the band. Thank you. So, next up is the moment that you have all been waiting for. We are going to perform the first two movements of our show this year. Welcome to the neighborhood. Hopefully you've heard some of this music around your house. If you have, it's probably gotten stuck in your head. I've been whistling it around the house, whistling it down the halls of the school, and it's not going to leave my head for the next three months. But we are really excited to show these first two movements to you. So, band, would you go ahead and get an opening set, please? Yeah.
And our drum majors are going to show you their salute. These were presented in order, first, second, and then play our third movement for you. Uh, we will not match the third movement, but we have a fourth movement to onto the field. And that will hopefully be and sometimes not So, here are the first two movements marching and playing, followed by the third movement playing. I'll let our front ensemble finish moving the tent.
I said, there's still one more movement that you haven't even heard yet. So, we started something during Amp Camp that they ended up really liking. Um, we've kind of done this in the past, but not to the extent that we did it. And it promoted a little bit of friendly competition and some healthy cheering. So what we ended up doing was we had each grade level, so 7th and 8th grade, freshmen, sophomores, juniors, seniors, split up, and they all marched to the show as a class. And it was pretty cool. And what ended up happening was we then had a battle of the underclassmen versus the upperclassmen. And again, we were really impressed with how it went. And so what we wanted to do for you is you just saw the whole show, but what our underclassmen are gonna do is show you what they can do in this first movement of our show, and then the upperclassmen are gonna show up, take over, and show you what they can do in the second movement of our show. So upperclassmen, why don't you clear off the field because it is our 7th, 8th, freshman and sophomore's time to shine. You got this, guys! Let's go! movement featuring our underclass.
go. He said, push this yes. button. Lift your tongue. Run. Hello.